was uh, going at the first there? Yeah, it was. I was trying to put a little emphasis on the curveball, throw it a few times. I didn't throw any sliders, but just wanted to come out of the gate. You know, I've thrown enough bullpens now that stuff's where you can just work on it you know, at any time. You don't really need, to, really need to break in three fastballs before you throw an off speed pitch. So I knew I was only going one inning to begin with, so I wanted to work on you know that pitch. And uh, threw two good ones. That one was good. And then the other one I threw later on was good, too. Just a little uh, thing that went around the plate, but the shape of it was great so from a personal standpoint stuff wise I'm ecstatic with today and and also getting a guy like Defoe to, to swing on the first pitch I mean I'm sure you're going to want to see a lot of that definitely once the season comes around I'll take outs as quick as they come and if I can get a lot of you know one two pitch outs that'll be allow me to get deeper into games which is something that we're all striving for as a pitching staff is to go deeper go longer so we need, you know, you need outs like that throughout a game to get you into the seventh, eighth inning consistently. So that'll be great if I can keep, you know, pounding. If I can pound the zone, establish that I, you know, can throw strikes on a day, you know, an outing, outing basis. It gets hitters in the swing mode, and you know, maybe I threw first three pitches for strikes. He was not going to wait around. So.